Good morning, everybody. Happy hump day. Hope everyone's having a great week so far. Today, we're gonna be working a little bit more on strength. So today we're gonna be doing two supersets followed by one triset. We're gonna be hitting full body. So don't worry, we're gonna make sure you hit all muscle groups. Now a superset is when you hit one exercise immediately followed by another without any rest in between. So we're gonna be going for two different supersets and then one triset. Now a triset is just like a superset, but we're gonna be doing three exercises. Now you might've noticed how there's a few numbers and letters next to some of the exercises today. Those numbers and letters refer to the tempo at which you'll be performing each repetition. The first digit in the sequence refers to the time that it's gonna take for you to perform the eccentric muscle action. That usually means lowering yourself to the ground. The second digit refers to the isometric hold at the bottom range of the movement. The third digit refers to the concentric muscle action phase, basically how long it takes for you to get back up. And then the last number refers to the isometric hold at the top range of the motion. Follow along as I demonstrate these exercises and I'll further explain what these tempos mean and how to use them. We will begin our first superset with an eccentric squat. With our squats, we wanna take about four seconds on the way down, pause for two seconds, and then explode up and repeat. We'll be supersetting our squats with a scapular or straight arm push-up. Start in push-up position with your core tight. Lower your chest to the ground while maintaining straight arms, then push away from the ground, pushing yourself back up and returning to push-up position. We'll begin our next superset with a heels elevated glute bridge. You can use a chair or a small step, it doesn't matter. Now we'll be performing this glute bridge with a 3-0-X-3 tempo. That means three seconds on the way down, no hold at the bottom, explode up, and then hold at the top range for three seconds. Make sure you're squeezing your glutes and keeping your core tight. The next exercise in our second superset will be a chair dip. We're using a 3-0-X-0 tempo, three seconds on the way down, no hold at the bottom or top, and make sure you explode up. Keep those elbows tucked in and core tight. Next, we're gonna finish out with our tricep. First exercise of the tricep is a hollow body hold. Maintain tight core, lift your shoulder blades and your legs up off the ground, and hold. Our next exercise in our tricep is a side-lying leg raise. Basically like a side plank with a leg raise added in. If you can't perform a standard sideline leg raise, perform with your bottom leg bent at the knee. To finish out our tricep, we have a reverse crunch. Squeeze your abs as you draw your knees into your chest, which will lift your hips up just slightly off the ground. All right guys, that was it for today. I hope you had a kick-ass workout. Make sure to like and subscribe, I would greatly appreciate it. Thanks guys.